Good morning, beds. Today is my official first day of summer. Yeehaw. And I'm at my grandparents' house. I'm house sitting again for the third year in a row. That explains the change in scenery. But yeah, officially on summer break, I asked y'all on my story this morning what type of content y'all want to see more of from me. Got a lot of vlog requests. Not surprised. Y'all like the vlogs. Thank God. I like vlogging too. It's just I forget to vlog throughout the day when I do vlog. So yeah, not that good at it, but I still enjoy doing it. <laughs> Bussin', but I need water. Much better. I really need to try to start being a hydrated queen because I go through like one water bottle a day if I'm lucky. I'm also watching the original Spider-Man movie and I forgot how good it is. I feel like the OG ones are definitely the best. And I really like Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man, but I just don't like the fact that they look like they're 30 trying to be high schoolers. I mean, maybe not 30, but those motherfuckers don't look like they should be in high school. And that's why I really like the newer Spider-Man movies with Tom Holland because I feel like they actually look more like they could be in high school. The first time I ever watched the Tom Holland Spider-Man movies, I was like, how old is this kid? And he wasn't even that young. I straight up thought he was a teenager and he wasn't. I decided to make waffles for breakfast because I didn't know what else to eat. And mm. the first couple of bites were really good, but now I'm slowing down and I'm like not even halfway done. Should have taken a hit before. Yeah, I don't think I can finish all these waffles. I'm gonna take one more bite. I'm not gonna force myself to eat a bunch of food when I can't. I don't really have any plans for the day. We're just kind of chilling or relaxing. Maybe gonna film a new video. Not entirely sure. Cause gotta film outside cause can't smoke in my grandparents' house. And it's fucking raining. That's not a good way to start summer. It's been pretty nice in Washington too. And then of course my first day of summer, it's pouring down rain. That's great. We're just gonna hang out today. And I'm gonna try to also not get this vlog age restricted. I'd love to start like, daily vlogging maybe or something not actually like every day you know but just more daily vlogging i just don't want every single vlog that i post to get age restricted you know because most of my sit down videos already get age restricted so it'd be nice if i could get the vlogs not age restricted you know <laughs> Oh my gosh, my Nana's cat Mia's right here on the chair. Didn't this happen last time I vlogged here? Because I know the kitties hang out on the chairs. Mia! Hey, come here. Don't leave. I'm giving you pet. She just went onto the other chair. Come here. I can hear her purring. Mia, come here. My Nana has the prettiest cats. She's purring super loud right now, like I'm petting her, but I'm literally just going, come here, Mia. And she's like, these cats are so funny. My Nana's other cat, Macy, came and cuddled with me this morning, and she literally had her head, like, laid up on my chest, and I was just rubbing her like she was a little baby. It was so sweet. Chino and Callie kind of get up, well, especially Callie, like, Callie really likes to snuggle, and Chino kind of will too, but he mainly just, like, digs his feet into me, and is like, pet me. These cats aren't heavy as Chino, <laughs> so they can't crush me. All right. Oh my god, I think she drooled on the chair. I know I've talked about this little scoop before in some of my videos, but it's seriously one of the best smoking accessories I have. <laughs> Especially when I don't have my nails, because usually when I have my nails, I like can scoop up the weed, you know? But when I don't, it's a little complicated and my fingers get all sticky. But with this little scoop, I can literally just scoop it up like this and then just put it in the bowl like it's so simple not sponsored or anything <laughs> like i really just love this thing it's from daily high club and i'm pretty sure they have it on their head shop if you guys want to cop one and you guys could get a little discount with my code green mama <laughs> if you want if you want i mean personally i really like saving money but i don't know that might not be everybody's thing my nana has a bird's nest in that basket and every time i come out here i feel like the birds are gonna attack me where do i want to put you guys. I can't sit anywhere because everything's wet. Oh my gosh. This is putting a little damper on my outdoor sish. Oh, okay. <coughs> Much better. <coughs> I'm 
wonder if I can see the mommy bird come back. The nest is literally just like peeked in right there. You can't see it. I can't see the mom, but I can hear them. They're yelling at me. They're like, don't you fucking come near our eggs. If you guys followed me like a while ago, then you might remember when I had birds hatch outside my bedroom window. Literally a little bird like laid a nest outside my window and two little birdies were born. It was great. I don't even like birds, but that shit was cool. There's a story highlight on my Instagram, I think, of the birdies. You wanna go check them out. And I thought that maybe more would get laid there like the next year and none never came back. It made me sad. Oh my gosh, Mia. I love you. Don't think you guys are getting free toe coverage. Oh, don't show the camera that. What are you doing? You coming with me? No, we're not going in there. We're going in here. Mia. Mia, this way. It's 12.30 now though. I think I'm gonna shower, maybe put on some makeup. I got a new makeup product that I've been waiting to try for months and I finally got it in the mail the other day. Haven't tried it yet though. So maybe I'll put some makeup on and try it out today. And I don't know. We're just vibing. It's the first day of summer. We don't gotta worry about anything. This is stupid, but do you guys ever like respond to something and you're like, wait, was that stupid? And then you start getting all anxious. Yeah, that just happened to me and I feel like my hit went away. So we're gonna take another hit and I feel anxious literally just because I responded to a text. <laughs> oh, Jack. <laughs> like not actually like, oh my God, I'm freaking out. But like, you know, like that scary feeling in your tummy that you're like, oh God, does that sound stupid? Or like, why am I overthinking this? You know, <laughs> like all these thoughts are going through my head now. It's also probably cause I just took a hit before that and I'm not stoned enough. <laughs> you guys are like, what the fuck is wrong with her? <laughs> Sometimes I feel like my responses to things maybe just are stupid, which I'm like, wait, why do I care? I don't know. And then I'm like, well, maybe I don't care. But then I'm like, oh, but why does my tummy hurt when I think about it? And then I'm like, probably just need more weed. You guys are like, oh girl and then i'm gonna take a shower that'll make me feel super good oh my god maybe when i open the door i can show you guys the bird is it there oh see there it is oh my god okay i feel bad for disturbing it we need to take this hit quick so it can get back to nesting it's literally right there it's fucking pissed i'm sorry Guys, it's really mad. <laughs> oh my god, okay. We need to go. It's yelling at me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I got this sample in the mail with my order from Sephora, which, by the way, <laughs> Great example of why I don't like Sephora. But the thing that I wanted to get was only available at Sephora. Why would you offer samples that you can like pick to choose from if you're not even gonna send the samples that I freaking pick out? I picked out a Clinique moisturizer because I've never tried any Clinique products and an Amica shampoo and conditioner sample because also haven't tried Amica and I've wanted to try that brand too. I didn't get either of those things. I did get a shampoo and conditioner sample. It's from Alterna, never heard of it. My hair, my canvas. Me time, everyday shampoo with botanical caviar. Oh, okay, caviar? Like actually, botanical caviar? I don't know what that is. Okay, and then I got some Caratis. I actually don't know what this is. Intense blonde strengthening oil. Oh, okay. Actually, that's kind of cool because I do get highlights in my hair. So maybe this will do some greatness. These are really fucking tiny samples. But I know you're not supposed to use like a lot of hair oil, but like you guys see how tiny these are? I need to get my nails done too. They are looking... Not good, don't look at them. Or should I say don't comment on them? Of course you guys are gonna look at them now. I'm gonna say shit about them though, okay. All right, I'm gonna clean myself. Okay, so remember how I said I was thinking about like maybe doing my makeup. I like, try not to do makeup I got and stuff like that. I don't know if I'm feeling bad anymore. After taking those two bomb rips, I'm feeling really hungry now. So I'm gonna have some lunch. Cause I'm starving. I have Spongebob on, it's like the newer Spongebob. If you know, you know. This shit's so fucking weird. And also, I made a Sloppy Jack. <laughs> My boyfriend and I had Sloppy Joes last night for dinner. 
but I started watching Modern Family and there's this episode where Jay has his like grandkids over and he's like, Hey, well, we're actually in pajamas and we have sloppy J's. They're sloppy Joes, but I'm Jay. And I was like, oh my God, I could have sloppy Jacks. <laughs> so that's what's for lunch today. I'm trying to decide if I want another one or if I want applesauce. I got some applesauce to snack on while I watch Modern Family. I don't know about you guys, but I fucking love applesauce. This shit is so good. Does anybody here watch Modern Family? Like I mentioned, I started it recently and I love it so much. I actually just remembered that I'm at my grandparents and they have like a shit ton of Barbie movies from when I was little downstairs. I don't want to watch a Barbie movie. Let's go see which ones there are. I know for sure there's 12 dancing princesses, but I don't know which other ones there are. Oh my gosh, Strawberry Shortcake? Oh my god, there's so many throwback movies in here. This is so funny. Brother Bear 2, My Little Pony. Oh my god. There's even princess movies in here. There's 12 dancing princesses. This is a classic. Oh my gosh, Barbie Fairytopia, Magic of the Rainbow, and Island Princess. Oh gosh, I think I'm definitely feeling 12 Dancing Princesses. That one is such a classic. I wish I had Swan Lake and Rapunzel and the Nutcracker. I know I had those ones at one point, but I don't know where those all went. Let's watch 12 Dancing Princesses. <laughs> yes. The picture is a little small and I think that's because I'm watching through my boyfriend's Xbox. And I think I can change it, but I don't want to fuck with it. So I'm just going to deal with it. Barbie movie for first day of Barbie summer. Who else was excited to see the Barbie movie? Because I fucking am. Oh, okay. It's just like normal now. That's cool. Yay! This is what I like to fucking see. The girls who get it, get it. And the girlies eat up, no. My boyfriend is with me now. He got off of work a couple hours ago and we're about to go pick up a pizza. But before we go pick it up, I want to try this makeup product that I was telling you guys about. The, what's it called? The Rare Beauty Positive Light Under Eye Brightener. I've heard lots of good things about this and I haven't been able to get it until recently. So... We're gonna see how it is. Comes with like this weird metal applicator. I don't know, it's supposed to kind of work like concealer, but not like concealer. It's supposed to brighten up your under eyes. So let's see how it works. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell on camera, but it definitely did what I wanted it to. Cool. I felt like this would be really good for the summer too because I don't like wearing a lot of makeup during the summer, but I do have like dark circles under my eyes and stuff. So I like putting concealer under my eyes so that I don't look tired as fuck. But I also don't even like wearing concealer sometimes. Concealer just feels like too much. Sometimes you feel. Yeah, I really like that. Cool. All right, we're gonna go get some pizza now. Oh my god. That looks amazing. We got double pets.